Another artist uh, affected people, much like Elvis affected you in the 60s, Dylan, yes. came along. And, and he, he actually had a big impact as a songwriter, even on the birds. Oh, yeah. yeah we did one of his songs. Actually, before he was a pop star, mm -hmm. he was a folk writer and folk singer. And we're, we're going to play that song in a second. There's, there's, there's two things, I think, that we should mention before you launch into this. It was the first Birds hit, correct? Yes. It was the first number one hit that you got. Mm -hmm. You're the only one of the Birds playing on the record. Yes, I was the only one they let play on it. Uh, I had about five years' experience as a studio musician by that time, and the other guys hadn't, so they let me play on it. But I was, it was such a, a wonderful feeling because I was playing with a band they called the Wrecking Crew who played on all the Beach Boys hits, all the Jan and Dean, all the, everything out, coming out of Hollywood. Hal Blaine, and it was uh, Larry Nechtel, Jerry Cole. Leon, Larry Nechtel was with, the, with Bread. With Bread later, yeah. 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 Leon Russell was in this, in this band, yeah. That was a hot Leon record. Russell, yeah. No wonder why it went to number one. Right. In 1965, Bob Dylan said of Roger McGuinn and the Birds, they're doing something new now, but if they don't lose their minds, they'll come up with something really fantastic. Bob said that? Bob said that. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go ahead into the song, because this is another tune that everybody sort of bent out of shape a little bit as far as the meaning of it. Well, I just want, well, the meaning, uh, I was doing it as a prayer. I was going, hey, God, you know, take me and use me any way you want. Mm -hmm. That was my meaning on it. I don't know what Bob meant. Well, but. we'll leave that part to Bob, the song, as famous as it is, and he's going to do it for us right now. Well, I just want to show you the, the way we heard it first before okay. we changed it up. It sounded like... Well, hey, Mr. Tambourine Man, play a song for me. I'm not sleepy and there's no place I'm going to. Yeah, Mr. Tambourine Man, play a song for me In the jingle jangle morning I'll come following you And David Crosby was in the band He said, I don't like it, man <laughs> He said, no, it's that folky 2-4 time It's never going to play on the radio So I had an idea I'd been playing around on my electric 12 with a little Rock like stuff. I thought if I put a bit of that on the front of it and maybe kick it up with a Beatle beat, it might come out okay for radio. So it came out like this.
Merci. Wow.